What's new in Echo Park? It's Saturday, October 25th, 2008, and this is a grand opening event at 2100 Echo Park Avenue. Hi, I'm Caroline, and I'm at the latest, newest, and hottest coffee shop of Echo Park, and it's called The Fix. And it's owned by Mark Gallucci. Mark, are you Italian? Yes, I am Italian. I am uh, half Italian, half Polish. My father's side is Italian, my mother's Polish. Now, what made you uh, come up with the idea to have another coffee shop on Echo Park? I have had, uh, I've been a coffee fanatic for, well, many years, and so I finally found a, an opportunity to make a place where I can make the coffee the way that I want it to be made and uh, take care of the customers the way I want them to be taken care of. And his customers most obviously like his way. Fix Coffee Shop opened only a few weeks ago and has already up to 150 clients per day, some of which are dressed up as for an early Halloween party tonight. And they are creative in real life too. There are a lot of uh, artists, musicians, uh, writers in this area and a lot of them work from their homes and so I was really excited to meet a lot of them and realize that they were looking for a place to come where they could kind of get out of their house and you know interact with the public and uh, have some fantastic espresso and coffee. Fix is fantastic actually I like it. Um, I like it a lot mostly because it's really close to my house. <laughs> it's got fantastic coffees. There's a lot of, of cafes on the close to sunset but on this side this is a great addition. There's really only one other coffee shop and I think that um, Fix has a much more modern um, appeal. Fix doesn't have its name because the place needed a complete design makeover before it became a coffee shop. Mark Gallucci simply wants it to be a place where people can get their daily fix for coffee and treats. And the location actually has a tradition in fixing things one way or another. Right before it was a recording studio, and then prior to that it was a delivery service, and prior to that it was actually a fiction or a service station. So the history for this place goes way back to the 30s actually. So at one point it was a, a real gas station. And, um, and then also during that time in the 50s, there was a time when there was a gentleman by the name of Art Ingalls who built Hindi racing cars for a living and he basically uh, built this first small go-kart with a lawnmower engine. From go-kart lab to coffee shop, what a change! Fix is open from 8 to 8 and offers sandwiches, croissants, cake, yogurt and a special ice cream from Michigan. So this is not a place for you if you are on a diet. But most importantly, Fix is serving high quality coffee from Costa Rica, a dark and a milder roast and Mark Gallucci is very particular about his brew. One of the most important aspects of getting a good flavor from a coffee and getting the coffee the way you want it to be is using really good water and so um, one thing about my place is we have a whole, whole water treatment filtration system that allows me to get the maximum amount of extraction from the beans. I like the way it feels. Fix Coffee Shop is a pet and child friendly place. It provides customers with Wi-Fi and sooner or later Marco Lucci wants to expand it to a neighborhood restaurant. There will be art openings and film shows sometime soon in the evenings and with a complete lack of bars in this part of Echo Park, the fix may become even more popular soon and keep its owner really busy. My background is actually in technology so for me this has been more or less a career change for me to go from being a consultant in technology to doing food service. It's always been a dream of mine to do a restaurant and this is was my first kind of step into a restaurant basically. So even though it is more or less a restaurant, it's a small scale and that's where I wanted to start. So get your cravings fixed at the fix and stay tuned for more news from Echo Park TV.